Okay, show so me. So Lea wants me to show my mobility. Yeah. Is this what? This, this is my max. Wait, wait. Let me warm up a little bit. Oh my god. No. You're even cheating. You need to have straight legs. This is really, really bad. <laughs> I give you a one out of ten. <laughs> She's lying. She wanted to see my mobility. Good morning. Good morning. Did you travel safe? Yes. Yes. Are you coming the whole week with us? Yeah. Or to, just... Yeah. To Saturday. I'm going home Saturday night. Okay. Good morning. Good morning. How are you? Good, thank you. It's so cute because they're all, all four together and you're just by yourself. <laughs> <laughs> are you officially back to training now? Yes, first yeah? day back now. Hi. Well, first, uh, like, special training day. How was your week last week, like, after the Nationals? Oh. First of all, congrats. Thank you. Yeah. It was like... Uh, Pretty chill. I was with some family in Stavanger. My yeah. father lives there, so don't get to see him too often. Mm -hmm. So I was there for a couple of days, so chilling, mm -hmm. hanging out, relaxing, yeah. not thinking about training or competitions. Is it frustrating for you when you have a week off like this with training? Oh, no, I love it. Yeah? yeah? I have no problem with it. Okay. <laughs> You're happy to have like the rest? Yeah. I feel like uh, when you train so much, you have earned it. So. Uh, yeah. I know a lot of people here are uh, impatient and want to get back to training and. Uh, feel like they're wasting time but uh, yeah. it's, uh, I feel like my um, mentally I'm charging up as well so I feel like yeah. I get it. How did uh, this year at the Nationals compare to last year? Uh, How did you feel? I was probably a bit more relaxed. I felt pretty confident in myself. So you, when you went on that podium did it feel different than the year before? Yeah, uh, yes, since, yeah, I would say so. It's been a uh, lot of changes uh, in my life that has happened in the last year. In a way, I felt really confident, but uh, I want to prove myself that I was uh, at the level I think yeah. I am. So yeah. I felt like I... No no imposter syndrome. You're truly putting the work and yeah. you deserve what you need. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So it, felt, uh, yeah, it felt good. But are you happy to be back in training though? Yes, now I am. I feel motivated okay. now. Okay. So, has nice. been a lot of competitions this year, so uh, I'm ready to train some more. Okay. Are you fully back into training last week? Yeah, I have a problem with resting. Yeah, because Marius was resting. But this week, are you gonna change anything because now you've taken some rest or are you just doing the same? I haven't got the, we call it Chnekian. Yeah. Norwegian. And I haven't got it yet. How? winning felt this year compared to the year before? Wow. Surprisingly. Yeah. And of course it was fun, but I think it was more fun last year. Was it? Yeah. In what like way? Like this year I was more surprised that I did it because the workouts were not in my favor. Okay. And I really did bad the first day, so... Yeah. But... Uh, did you catch up some points later on? Yeah, in events that I normally don't do well in. Okay. Yeah. Which were? I cleaned 100. Yeah. And I struggled with 90 kilos for the last month leading up to Madrid and Anam, yeah. the Nationals, and the did, power event as well. Did you feel the energy from the Norwegian community? Or did that help you for the lift, or was it just No, it, it's the opposite, because when I use the crowd, I tend to underperform. Okay. On lifting, on the events that I have confidence in, okay. I perform better with the crowd. So. Okay. They are all doing the flow and you're by yourself <laughs> benching. Yes, but that looks weird. Did you do the flow by yourself before? Uh, or... No, there was a class, so there were like people like stretching yeah. and stuff. Yeah. And today I did the Krieger warm, warm up that okay. was like on the app. Yeah. So it was a 30 minute uh, arm up with like biking and some dumbbell stuff. <laughs> 
congrats on Nationals. Thank you. How was it for you? It was a good feeling. Yeah. I took second place last year, so it was a motive was just to win this year. You were chasing for that first place. How did the workout feel for you? Was it good workouts? Yes, uh, the skill uh, workout was a bit challenging, but I like the rest of the workouts. It was good. Yeah. What's your? What are your strengths? Strength. Strength. Okay. Hello! Oh, I hate this filming position. So, we do the human flag progression that we will do every week. So, we start here and then we just press ourselves out as high as possible. Do you come to CFO to train often during the season? Does it happen? We don't know yet. That's why. I'm no, I mean I in know. general in the past years. No, no, no. I've never been here. No way. No. Okay, okay. And I lived also, like also just one hour from here, like in Sweden. So no way. Know, it's embarrassing. I've never... Do you have like a good training crew back in? No, that's Sweden. the thing. I don't. Yeah. So that's why I want to have a good training crew. It's so nice to be why. like around all these people. Yeah, yeah exactly. Okay. Oh yes, do you have a specific target for you today? Or um, I think I just have to take it slow. My elbow got a little bit banged up in uh, the rogue qualifier, so uh, mm -hmm. I'm just trying to keep some light snatches and uh, okay. just to keep the movement in the body so mm -hmm. I don't feel... Uh, you're following the template but you're just oh, adapting. Yeah. Uh, the focus now is like the World Championship for Functional Fitness yeah. in the uh, end of November. Yeah. So the, okay. the program starts now. Go Lea, lightweight. Oh, Easy. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> I'm filming. <laughs> I have never seen something like this before. <laughs> Holding on to nothing. It's super smart. Uh, no, it's not. Come on. Come on, one more. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Bro rep? Sorry. Give me a bro rep though. Yeah, uh, bro rep maybe, <laughs> but. Yes, sir. Lightweight. <laughs> yeah, this is the downstairs setup. What do you mean? It's perfect. <laughs>
Marius, is this the diet of a champion? Yes, this is 24-7. Uh, okay, it's what like are you eating? Eggs and bread. Just this? Yes. Okay. So I eat like four to eight eggs a day. Okay. Mm. Do you calculate your calories or are you just... I just eat as much as possible all day, every day. I, I try to have like proteins in every meal. Yeah. But it's not like I, I don't count anything. Okay. That's too much job, I think. Yeah. May just make sure to eat a lot. That looks. Uh, I'm not gonna say it looks good. No, <laughs> looks. <it's>, uh, <laughs> it looks I dry as fuck, man. Yeah. I mean, put some something on it, like <laughs> so dry. Yeah, that's okay. like uh, the champions mindset. You have to just get it done. Yeah. <laughs> What's the lunch of a national champion? <laughs> I did the same thing with Mario. So we have eggs. That's why it's eggs. That's why it stinks here. Eggs. Eggs. So I. Eggs. My stomach is really sensitive. Okay. So before I have to do a matcom, so I have baby food. Okay. And I don't actually like baby food, but this is with sweet potato. And okay. those who know me knows that everything that has sweet potato, that's... That's your jam? Yeah. And I have uh, bread, because we are Norwegian and <laughs> I always eat bread. Dutch people also eat bread all the time. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh, with uh, chicken. Yeah. And we have uh, yogurt. Skir. Skir. Yeah. And then we have uh, we have fruit. Okay, good. So I have um, apples instead of bananas because I'm an apple girl. Okay. And if uh, this is not enough, I will have a banana mm. and maybe some more carbs. Do you do your own diet? <laughs> yes. Yeah. Well, I have <clears throat> I have RP strength as well.
Yo, Kim, yeah. can you tell me what's the best strategy to approach for this workout you guys just did? Uh, start with a number, think about the number you think you can hold for the five rounds, and then go down two or three repetitions, because yeah. that's probably more, more true. And then just hanging there. Just hanging there. 35 minutes. Yeah, the hardest thing is the third round, yeah. where you're in the middle of it. Yeah. Be I'll mentally strong, I guess. Stay with your rep, because you can probably do it, but as soon as you lose one interval, yeah. you will lose a lot more. And it's also to go directly from the buy-in movement to the working movement, because it's so easy to take a few seconds before that, but then you lose track of everything.